Are you ready to build your own AI chatbot mobile app? One you can publish in app stores or use as an internal tool for your team. Let's walk through how you can do it step-by-step -step using Bravo Studio. Step 1. Design your app in Figma. Start by designing your app in Figma or duplicating one of Bravo Studio's sample apps available in the Figma community or our documentation. Your app can be simple. For example, a login screen and a main screen that will host your AI chatbot as a web view. Make sure to add the appropriate web view tag using the Bravo Studio Figma plugin. Step two, set up user authentication with Kind. If you don't already have one, create a free account on Kind. This will handle user authentication for your app. You can find full detailed instructions on how to set up Kind authentication in our docs and we've also added them in the video description. In this tutorial, we're using the Bravo External OAuth Zano snippet to connect Kind with our Zano backend. Once you've completed the authentication setup and tested it successfully in your app, it's time to set up your AI chatbot. Step three, configure your AI assistant. For this tutorial, we've already created our own AI assistant. In this case, an AI cycling coach using OpenAI. If it's your first time setting one up, make sure to load at least five US dollars into your OpenAI account to test your new AI assistant. Step four, integrate the AI assistant in your app. With your AI assistant ready, it's time to bring it into your app. Install the Bravo Studio OpenAI Assistant Xano snippet, just like we did with the authentication snippet. Configure your snippet by adding your OpenAI API key and your unique OpenAI Assistant ID. Next, copy your assistant's get URL endpoint and add a new get API request to your data collection in Bravo Studio. Click send. If successful, you'll get your assistant's URL in the API response, which you can test in your browser. Step five, bind the AI assistant to your web view. In your app project in Bravo Studio, select the web view element. Then, select the right data collection and bind it with the corresponding data. In this case, your AI Assistant's URL. Step six, test your app in Bravo Vision. Now that everything is set up, you're ready to test your app using Bravo Vision. Open Bravo Vision. Select your newly created app and authenticate yourself using your kind authentication flow. And there it is. You're ready to start your training journey with your virtual cycling coach. Ask how it can help you, provide your personal information and goals, and get a personalized training plan. All from within your app. Are you ready to build your own AI Assistant app? Enjoy building with Bravo Studio.